Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. We are just in the middle of homeschool and we are just discussing how tomorrow is Halloween. Halloween and we're not even prepared because we're last minute people. Look at that. That's what you wanna do? No, but look at it. It's a woolly mammoth. So Gabby recently got Pinterest. How are you loving it? Good. She loves it and she's been looking up Halloween costumes for our horses. But I don't know how we're gonna like That's Stella. figure okay. out a Halloween costume for our horses. So, me and Stella are going to be princesses, but I need a prince. Storm's a prince. I don't Storm know. might be a knight in shining armor. <laughs> okay, so these are all the ones they have. I only had a few. I'm getting lots of kisses here from Macy. Okay. This one would be so cool. Like, look at that. Yeah, she wants to make her horse look like he's ripped open. I do not love that one at all. And mom's like, is that real? And I'm like, no, it's paint. And then there's this one, which is a knight. I want that so bad. We're so going to be princesses. There's a skeleton, which I want to do. Yeah, with. she really wanted to do a skeleton, but we just never ordered anything. I, I looked a few times to see. All you need is to just to go to Bridal Path and buy the horse spray paint. Spray paint for Yeah, horses. but who's going to draw bones that nice? Me. I know. So that one's really cute, too. It's Elsa and what's that guy's name? <laughs> It's an Anna and no Spen. 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 <laughs> There's Levi. Levi's coming. That's cute. He went to a doctor's appointment and said he'd be back to go to the barn with us. And yeah, it's almost Halloween. Gabby is about to stab me with a knife. What are you doing with a big knife? Fan mail. Guys, I'm scared of a knife. I'm scared of those. I get to right, so uh, the girls got some letters and they're anxious to open them and show you guys. Sophie and Stella. Sophie and Stella forever. Yeah. Oh God, it's in cursive. Um, Right, so a great picture, but like Sophie got a letter from Nia. My name is Nia and I have been watching your videos for a year. I'm twelve years old and I live in Ontario, Canada. And she sent us this letter on October the twenty second and we got it already. Um She said that she has dreamed about us and wished Sophia a very happy birthday. Thanks, Nia. And Gabby got a letter written in cursive, and look at these pictures. These look like really old pictures. Yes, Gabby. Who are these from? This is amazing. Oh, I recognize the name. Uh, dear Day by Day, I thought I would share a few old, and I do mean old pictures of my sweet horse, Bold Lancer. Lance for short. These pictures were taken in 1971. That's cool. When digital cameras were obviously not available. She was 27 years old. And this is her very sweet boy Lance. And I recognize the name. I don't know if she wants me to put it in her videos. But I love it. And he is so gorgeous. Look at him. I know. I love him. Hi. I love him too. I wonder what breed. Did she say what breed he is? He is gorgeous. <laughs> that, these are amazing. I'm excited to keep these. Thank you so much for your letter and your pictures. These are amazing. Thank you. Oh my gosh, that's you. Yes, me and Storm. Gabby and Storm. That's a nice one to hang up in your room. Yeah. And Sophie got one too. Sophie and Stella. Sophie and Stella in the water. Yeah, I love the pictures of the water. <laughs> oh, I love that one too. Love Storm and I in the water. Yeah, they're amazing. Who are those from? Um, let me see if I can read this. It's a really pretty letter. Yeah. Dear Day by Day, her name is Abby and she's 15 and she's from Western Australia. Uh, she started oh, watching our channel. Storm. Storm looks so big compared to Macy. She started watching our channel a little over a year ago. Um, she loves animals. She has three dogs, Bonnie, Pippa, and Nancy, and a cat named Sylvester. Loves horses, but she doesn't have one yet. She also says that she hopes that Stella gets soon, uh, gets well soon, and she knows we will never give up on her. We will never. Um. Oh, she is day by day edits. 
Oh, yeah. Gabby's like, I know her. Didn't she just make an edit of you recently? Thanks, Abby. Thank you for all your edits. They've been amazing. And these beautiful pictures. Yeah, they're so cool. I love that one right there of when Macy met Storm. Gabby's two biggest loves finally met each other. Macy's like, get him away. And Storm was like, hey, baby. <laughs> And our trail ride. Um, also, day by day edits. Abby sent these amazing lead rope and halter. And we this, both got this one too. We love them. Okay. This next one is from Mel. And it's a book. <laughs> and it's this one Rider Biomechanics. That looks good. Yeah. Um, Mel says, hi Gabby, I thought you might find this interesting. I've been to one of the author's clinics in the UK and it was great. Happy writing, all the best. Thanks, Mel. I think this is a good book for us to work together on in homeschool as well. Like just reading a couple of chapters every single day during our reading or even a page every day. I think that we could learn a lot. It is gorgeous out here. Woo! I see a lot of leaves. Maybe when we get home from the barn, we can rake all these leaves up. Help dad. And make a pile of stuff to make. Gabby's like, no way. Yeah, let's do it like the old days. Ever since we got horses, we have no time for anything else. Oh, remember with Bet you guys can relate to that. What? Remember with Zeus? Zeus loved the leaves. Yeah, Ruby probably loved the leaves too. Let's do it when we get home. I can see what we are. Don't know where we belong. Want to know what you're thinking. Want to know what something's missing. Started stories before, but they ended up short. Get me up to higher places. Want you to feel my pages. Is this for real or is it just a fantasy? Grab every single bit of horse stuff out of my car. My car is starting to smell like horses. So we got a good compromise for the Stella weight problem. So basically she's going to be in this little field just with her hay. And then after all the hay is gone from the other field, she'll go into that field so she can be with her friends. Because basically what she does is she eats like everybody's hay. So I want I listened to that podcast again today. You know the one I've been talking about, uh, the Equine Devil's Advocate. She has a new podcast out today. And I talked about, you know, the pony in her last story that I was explaining to you guys, how um, how she fixed the pony. Well, at the beginning, she talked about she went into the field and the pony charged at her. And how, in today's video, she talked about how she knew that the pony was just playing a game with her and wasn't going to really hurt her. And it was by watching her eyes, his eyes. What? Oh my what? gosh, Stella. We have to just come daily even just to bath you because you're such a mess. But yeah, it was about talking about how she could tell what the pony's intentions were based on the look in his eye. And Stella has such a like a sad look and a and a kind, sweet look. Obviously, that moment that she took off in the round ring and decided to jump, the very first thing that I noticed was she put her head up and she had a look in her eye and you could tell that there was the devil inside of her. Anyways, yeah, I found her story really interesting today. She posts two times a week, and I, it's really helping me, like, just to get a different Today perspective. We're just, I'm just going to play with Stella to give her a little bit of a break. Look at that, you guys. yesterday we Can you guys see? Her. Like, she's doing that herself. She had her chin right on Sophie. Like, she does love Sophie. Yes, yeah, she kind of babies me, because, like, we're still a beginner. But I like horses to baby me, especially Storm. Quick, Tex is working his way here. Tex is like, I'm going too. You guys see him? Come see this side, Gabby. Go to this side. Hey, Stormy Poo. Look, there's Chung. There's Chung. There is Chung. A row interfere is in four days. Four days is a shopping spree that we're going to go on. And 
We've been saving for this big shopping spree. And in reality, I don't think we can fit any more stuff. Like, that's disgusting. Like, I have to clean it out. Let's look at Gabby's. Okay, it's a little cleaner, but not much. Okay, so not a lot better. Basically, we need to get like some kind of shelving system. We need a locker as big as this tucker. We need two lockers each because, yeah. Hmm. So we could put that bucket up on top there, like everybody has their buckets. Except for that, I need um, some place to put all the saddle pads. Guys, I'm getting my mom to help me brush. With curry comb. Yeah, because Stella. Well, the only thing can get dirt out. Yeah. So some people were telling me that they actually vacuum their horses with real vacuums. Lately, I've been asking you guys like a lot of questions about your opinion on stuff, and it's not because I'm judging your your opinions or any of that kind of stuff, but it's because I'm curious what you guys say. Like, I really like reading all the different opinions from the different countries, from the different age groups, from all the different people. I learn a lot that way. Helps me figure out why people say the things they say. And so instead of me feeling frustrated, I can be like, oh, well, I think what they mean is this based on all the stuff I read. So thank you for that. Thank you for answering all my questions. And now I have another one for you. So some of you guys have been saying that Stella seems like she needs more support on her back. And I got this, which is like a gel, which I don't like the gel because it feels like, like it's soft to touch. I don't know, but it feels like it gets hard over time. But so there's that, or there's this one. Wait, that's up backwards. And it's um, like a soft spongy material the one that we have now is like a styrofoam kind of material so yeah i don't know what do you guys think what do you guys do you think we need something different suggestions recommendations um we're not going to use any of these until we check it out with our trainer because she knows she'll know she'll tell us what we need um right now we're using this and so it's kind of like a foam padding Probably the same thing as what we have in there, just that has a cover. But this one is super worn. Like not so much at the back, but up at the front. So I don't know. By the looks of it, it's the same as that one. But we'll find out. Like I said, comment below. Door. Door. You're using your new lunging rope? She's figuring it out all by herself. Today's a roll boxing day at the barn. Yes, Gabby is not doing any jumping. I lose my breath whenever I see you. You stole my heart. What is it that you do? Four more days until we're going to the Royal Winter Fair. Gabby's in hate with her saddle now. Is she done? Now you can play with her? That's the trouble with riding in a really nice saddle. You never want to go back. I 
I love the days we come out and Gabby just um, practices and does her own thing and just perfects things that, tries to perfect things that she's learned. She's like that ever since she was a little girl. You set my world on fire You're my heart's desire I just wanna love you, just wanna hold you Just wanna be with you till we grow old You sell me, you'll stay, or take me away I want you for myself every single day You say I don't know what it is you do I just want you I just need you I don't know what it is you do I just wanna love you Just wanna hold you Just wanna be with you Till we grow old Just tell me you'll stay Or take me away I want you for myself Every single day You say I dare you to ride without anything. Challenge accepted. Okay. There you go. All right, am I taking it off? Come here, bend forward. All right, there it goes. Gabby's riding with nothing but a helmet. And vest. And vest, because, and boots. She decided to put a neck rope on. No, to try and get him to listen because basically he hears that she's putting grain in the buckets out there in the barn. Oh, so yep, yeah, it's not working out. He's going back where he wants. She brought him all the way down at this end of the arena. And now he's like, I'll just go where I want. All right, get him to turn. What? Get him to come this way. Okay, come on this way. So clearly this is something we could work on. <laughs> okay, that's crazy. Like, the horse that listens to whatever she says. She well, takes the bit out of his no mouth. Yeah, she takes the bit out of his mouth and he's like, we're doing what I want now. He just wants to go bite Stella. Yeah. Stella should go out of the arena. Alright, well. It's easier. Okay, this is disastrous. Okay, bring him this way. Go. There he goes. Go. Ready to get rid of Stella. Good job. Good I think I'll just go over these poles. Good boy. Go. Uh oh. Bring him this way. Okay, now come this way. Let's do a little trot this way. No, bring him this way. Basically, he's not going anywhere. He doesn't want to go without the bit. There we go. Yay. It's like no. <laughs> Just a circle. He thinks he's going for food. 
he's not doing anything bad. Like he's not being mean. He just is going in his own direction. So keep walking him up there and then turn him around as you get to the door and bring him this way. That was disastrous. I have always been, been on the outside looking in. Never had a place where I belong. That was until you came along. And from that moment I knew, I knew that it would be you. Yeah, from that moment I knew, I knew it could only be you. I want your name up on my wall. Circle it in it. Do you guys see any special leaf in there in that pile? Look at you guys, our leaf pile is alive. Can you see it moving? Yeah. Ah! Pile's alive. She's alive. Ah. <laughs> I was scared. <laughs> oh my God, it's yellow. The leaves are yellow. Oh, the leaves are yellow. Whoa, so beautiful. Yeah. We should do fun pictures. Sophie, get ready and jump on those leaves. Three, two, one. <laughs> oh, my hair. My turn, my turn. My hair. My hair. This is how my hair is. That's a good Halloween costume. Two, one. <laughs> right into the dog poop. No, what? All right, you guys, we are going in to make supper. I'm making steak today. We haven't had steak in a long time. I'm super excited. Um, by the time you guys watch this, it will be Halloween. And um, so I just wanted to say, Happy, Happy Halloween. Halloween! Happy Halloween, you guys. Comment below what you guys dressed up for as, or what you're about to dress up as. And let me know um, if you guys wait till the last second to get your costume together too. We didn't even cut pumpkins. Horses ruined our lives. Horses ruined our pumpkins. lives. Yeah, we, we might have to go get pumpkins and do that tomorrow. Halloween. Stay safe, stay warm, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.